One thing you're going to want to know for sure before purchasing your hood is what size you need. Hoods come in all different lengths and they even come in a variety of depths. The main thing you'll need to know for the length of the hood is going to be what's actually under the hood itself. So you're going to need to know what equipment you're going to have, what size that equipment is, and then once you add all that length together, keeping in mind that you might want to have a little bit of space in between some of your equipment, add all that up and then add 12 inches. Fire code requires that from the end of each piece of equipment at each end of the hood, you have at least a six inch overhang of the hood. So again, when you have your total length of equipment under the hood, you need a six inch overhang on this end and a six inch overhang on the other end. That's very important. If you don't have a six inch overhang from the end of your last piece of equipment to the end of a hood, you can use a vertical end panel. These actually come in several different depths, but this will create a barrier or even a wall which will allow you to put that piece of equipment closer than six inches to the end of the hood. Another thing you're gonna to need to know is the depth of the hood, and that's the distance from the wall to the end of the hood. This, for example, is a 60 inch depth. Based on the equipment you have under that is gonna determine if you need a 60, a 52, or even some will have a 48, but that's all determined by the equipment that's under your hood. So before purchasing a hood, you really do need to know what equipment you're gonna have under there. If you're not 100% sure what size you need, give us a call, shoot us an email, we'll walk you through the steps to help you determine what size you need.